Sounds good. Yes. Street, and it's a little tiny house, and I wanted to mark it during the bicentennial because I was chairman of the historic sites, and I couldn't figure out who it belonged to. I had to research them to prove, and all I could figure it was on Blanche property. It was the nearest I could come. Did Blanche? I know he owned a lot of Drew. Did he own as far over as Park Avenue? I mean, math and try to figure that out. Um, I mean, two thousand acres sounds like a lot to me. So um it's probably most likely, you know, originated from Monche. So. Yeah, because uh, I don't know. Uh, right. Madison Avenue, I don't think it was there at the time. So he owned Drew, he could own all the way over to Park Avenue. Right. That's another thing. Yeah. But yeah, you I just thought maybe if you own your map, because his thing was near yeah. Bernier. Yeah. 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 And it's a tiny little house and it's still there. Most of the properties on the maps that we used are named, and so it may be on the map. However, Natalie may have trimmed it off in order to get it down to the right size on the board. So, but we do have the originals either at the Historical Society here or, or copies that Natalie has, so we can certainly take a look at that. Neat. Mm -hmm. Any other questions for the students? Yes. Okay, so he lost family members. Yeah. Okay. Tom? I did some research on Lafayette and and I found out this guy was so interested in America. At 19 years old, he was an officer in the military and ran a blood He got beside George Washington immediately before the war was over. When he came back in his own ship, he brought uniforms, cannon balls, food, and $300,000 of his own money yeah. Well, once again, I just wanted to thank all the kids for their hard work, and thanks everybody for coming out to support them and see what they did. I'd like to also thank the kids very much. It was a pleasure working with them, and I, I did... Uh, I uh, want to thank Kate and Karen and, and Sue for their help um, with helping their research. So um, please, we have more cookies. I think the coffee's still going, so um, help yourself. And um, yeah, hope to see you at the next meeting. Thank you.
Thank you. You have been watching a presentation of Rosenet TV, an internet TV channel for the borough of Madison, New Jersey. Rosenet TV is a private enterprise operated independently of the municipal government of the borough of Madison, New Jersey. Any views expressed herein are solely the views of Rosenet TV and do not represent the views of the municipal government of the borough of Madison.